as you know, this party is a farewell to Mr. Bonafide, who was kind enough to be the referee at all our matches. It's too bad he's leaving, Eriko. He was a really great ref. <laughs> great ref. That's like saying a really nice injury. Come on, Hazelnuts. Let's huddle up for the passing of the whistle. We've called a few fouls in our day. So long, partner. Congratulations, Daniel! The whistle chose you, son. May you be worthy of it. You, a ref? Can you imagine? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> so dumb. What a joke. Seriously, Daniel, throw that thing in the trash. More laid back now without a ref, right? This is terrible, Erico. There are no more rules. Oh, come on. Don't over dramatize things. Daniel? <laughs> What authority? Little traitor. Erico, did you know that football cleats weren't made for gouging people's shins? They're actually meant to grip the turf. What? Who told you that? It's right here in the football rule book. I've learned tons since I became a ref. <laughs> ref, after everything I've done for you, this is how you repay me? But Erico, the ref is the keeper of the rules. Without rules, there's no harmony on the field. Football is 22 pairs of cleats and a ball. The only rule is to win. But Erico, the whistle chose me. I have to enforce the rules. Let me remind you that to get my body back, you have to become a champion. What are you gonna do? Become a champion referee? The better I know the rules, the better a player I'll be. For now, I feel like this is the road I have to take. He'll see how I deal with referees. What's with all this money? I don't know, Daniel. By the looks of it, someone with wads of cash is willing to pay you wads of cash to quit refereeing. It's you, isn't it? Wads of cash. No thanks, Eriko. Don't worry, little ones. No one can resist your charms for long. Too good for my wads of cash, is that it? No one can bribe referees, Erico. No one! Rules are rules! Hmm. Rules are rules, are they? You'll see, Daniel. Live by the rule book, die by the rule book. Article 1. The football field is a rectangular space, demarcated by. Oh! Come on, Blatana. Focus. Demarcated by unbroken lines, which, no, no, that's too boring. With a circumference between 68 and 71 centimeters, the ball is round. No! A match normally consists of two halves of 45 minutes. No. Mr. Bultana, I think we've got something. There we go. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs>
Daniel, I just wanted to say, I was wrong to try to bribe you. No biggie, Eriko. It's all in the past. No, no, you were right. Rules are rules. So, what do you think about Article 75, Line 3, Subparagraph 17, B? Uh, the rule on player uniforms? Bingo! How does it go again? The only... the only... The only uniform allowed on a football field would consist of a t-shirt, shorts, high socks, and cleats. Any deviation from this uniform will be penalized. <laughs> hey, you, Daniel! But, Eriko, I can't penalize them for that. Maya is terrified of shoes. Steven sweats like a farm animal, and Maple loves his bees. Rules? Ah, <sighs> our rules. And according to the rules, you should ban them from playing for... Six years! Six years! I can't do that, Eriko. That's my team. The hazelnuts are my friends. There is another solution, but... <sighs> you aren't gonna like it. We could turn a blind eye. Just this once. But, Eriko, we can't just choose which rules count and which ones don't. You're the one holding the whistle, Daniel. <laughs> I can't! Bye, Daniel! I love it when you're the ref! Yeah, that whistle fits you like a glove. I feel all weird, Eriko. Like nothing makes sense anymore. You made the right decision. Everyone's happy. Two kinds of people in this world, Daniel. Those who play by the rules and those who are free. <laughs> so, not picking up after ourselves anymore. Way to go, rebel! So, not using a knife and fork anymore. Way to go, rebel! Going to bed with your shoes on. Way to go, Rebel. <laughs> Not taking showers anymore. Way to go, Rebel. You're uh, you're eating out of your shoes. I don't know about this one, Daniel. <laughs> Are you sure you don't want to whistle that foul? Ah! You're really sure? Sorry, Eriko. I can't do this anymore. Daniel? Daniel, wait up! Your whistle! Oh, no. What have I done? Once you've joined the Road Warriors, you're in for life. You sure you want to become a biker, little guy? Then welcome to a world without rules. Hey there, Daniel. Looks like that whistle might have been a little too heavy for your young shoulders. Mr. Bonafide? Oh, I think the whistle chose the wrong person. I couldn't decide between the rules and my friends. The whistle is never wrong, but a referee can make mistakes. Rules are important, but it's how you apply them that really matters. Shark and the bra steaks on my belt? Steven! 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 Steven, get down from there! Take down that ramp! And somebody put that shark back in the ocean! Oh. As long as I'm on the field, with this whistle around my neck, we play by the rules. What authority! Hi, 
I hate to admit this, but you're pretty good with a whistle. Thanks, Eriko. But you know, I think I'm gonna trade it back in for my cleats. Seriously? There's one wrong that this whistle can never right. Yeah? What is it? Your curse. No, oh, Daniel. Hello? What? Referee a semi-final in 20 minutes? Oh, but I hung up my whistle. <sighs> That's my Daniel! Go on, you're almost there! Almost? Are you kidding me? Nice job, Hazelnuts. If we play like that tomorrow, we'll really show Mr. Maslovich a thing or two. Mr. Maslovich? Mr. Maslovich? The scout for the Premier League? That guy's the most influential person in the biz. If he asks you inside the limo, jackpot! But if he kicks you to the curb, it's over. This is the chance of a the chance of a lifetime! Not yet. If Mr. Maslovich sees Daniel now, his career is dead in the water. He'll never be a football star and I'll never get my body back! Unlike the hare, rabbits live in groups and dig burrows that... I need a plan. Maslovich must never see Daniel play. You see that, Eriko? <laughs> Buddies are eating the football field. Not now, Daniel. Ruining the football field. Yes, but how? They're saying rabbits can eat three times their own body weight in grass. Not now, Daniel. Eat the grass. That's it. But who would do that? They're calling rabbits the plague of the pitch, the terror of the turf. Hold on, Daniel. Hmm, rabbits. Rabbits? That's the answer. I'm a genius! Hazelnuts, we must fix the field before Mr. Maslovich shows up. <laughs> Mr. Maslovich! No! It was the chance of my life! Eh, don't worry. I'm sure he'll be back in a few years. All right, back to training. This is all your fault! Mm -hmm. You're just so... You're just so... So adorable! about a rodent problem? Yeah, it's about time. I called you guys over five minutes ago. Stop! Don't you hurt them! <clears throat> they belong here, too! Mm -hmm. Hands off the groundhogs! Rabbits, Dad. The rabbits. Hmm. Okay. Yay! Yay! We did it, Hazelnuts! The people's voice has been heard! Hang on! We may have won this time, but they'll be back. We need to form a resistance. Yellow? Mom, you should sit down. I've got some heavy, heavy news. 
Did you trip over your laces again? You want the boo-boo song? <sighs> I'm not coming home tonight, Mom. The team needs me here to save the rabbits' lives. I don't know when I'll be back, but I know when duty calls. Okay, so which cuddly toy do you want me to bring over? Friends, my toys, rabbits, and marshmallows. This is heaven, Erico. This huh? is heaven. Oh, yo, 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 yo. Yo, yo Rastafari. This is a nightmare, Daniel. Mm. Everyone's running around barefoot and the field is wrecked. That's okay. It'll grow back. Oh, yeah? What about my body? Will my body grow back, too? How are you going to practice? You know, Erico, there's more to life than football. Ah, I think you made a new friend. <sighs> Would you stop it? No! Fluffy likes tiny slices. Let me do it. Snowball's belly there. She hates that. Let me do it. Hmm. No! You have to brush top to bottom, otherwise Thumper doesn't like it. Let me do it. No! Let me do it. No! Let me do it! No, Daniel! We've got a real bond, Jeremy and I. It's not Jeremy, it's Thumper! Okay. Hmm. Daniel won't let anyone do anything. Yeah! yeah. He even made Steven cry. Hmm? <laughs> Jeremy! It's okay. It's just my allergies. We need to do something. Yeah! <laughs> Get off my back! Hmm? Settle down, hazelnuts. If we simply open our minds, Mother Nature will tell us what to do. Give up on Daniel. That'll teach him. Huh? Well, this one didn't take long. You're all leaving? What about the rabbits? You leave us no choice. You're hogging the rabbits, Sisu. You. You. Jeremy! <laughs> what? Don't worry, Chestnut. We don't need any of them. Just you, me, and Erico. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just the one kid. I'll bring a big cage. They're multiplying like... like... No! Well, like rabbits. You ratted us out, Erico. Yeah, I'll call you back. How could you do that to Ginger? And to Patches? And to Cinnabon? And to Snowball? And to Roger? Oh, wait. That one's Fiona. I always get that mixed up. <laughs> Since these rabbits arrived, you've forgotten something, Daniel. My curse! Getting my body back. Getting my life back. My curse! It's always about you, Erico. Forget it. You really let us down. Listen up. Our enemy will be here soon. But together, we are more than just a group. My fellow bunnies, we're a whole Army! Hmm? No one takes these bunnies as long as I'm here. Hmm. Okay. Here you go. This is all my fault, Erico. I'm the reason the hazelnuts all left. The rabbits had to go, Daniel. Practice comes first. How else am I going to get my body back? Floppy! Floppy! Quick, Daniel! We gotta get them out of there! Wow! <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> it's it's over, Daniel. We've lost. Bunnies are our buddies. Bunnies are our buddies. Bunnies are our buddies. Guys, you came back. The little people always conquer, Daniel. We couldn't let your selfishness destroy the cause. Bunnies are our buddies. Bunnies are our buddies. Mm, okay. okay. Go. Hmm? What are we gonna do with all these rabbits? Leave it to me. <sighs> Is this the life or what? Yeah! Wait, where's Floppy? I made a few calls. Trust me, this won't be the last time we hear about Floppy. This time you are going down. Combo combo! Supreme humiliation! No! This controller's broken! Give me yours! I'm off, sweetheart. Have a good day with your best friend. <laughs> what do you mean, Mom? It's just me. Oh, Daniel. How could you forget Mr. Tickles? Oh, yeah! <laughs> Mr. Tickle sure is my best friend in the world. Be good, you two. And not too much TV, okay? Maybe you want a little space just for you and your best friend. Come on, Erico. Mr. Tickles is just my cuddly toy. Didn't you ever have one? My cuddly toy? I had completely forgotten. Such a nice smell. Like vanilla and warm bread. Had a little mustache and actively took part in several revolutions. Huh? Abuelita, my old nanny. She's the one who looked after me when I was little. Ah. Anyway, that's all in the past. Who knows where she is today? Hmm. Hmm. Old nanny. You know I hate surprises. Ta-da! Abuelita! Kion mi faras, Titi? Abuelita! I can't believe it! I've missed you so much! Mi ti amava estranja. Zongoi, se ti ju tre amusas. She says that I'm too skinny and that we'll need to fat me up. Are you sure she can see well? Oh, Pichu Pluma del Caboso, Chopolo Bamba Marcia Baila. There's so much to tell you. So many victories, zero defeats, some doubts. <laughs> some doubts. Ah, Daniel, this is kind of personal. Could you give us a little space, please? Back up. More? The door. Can I come back now? No! How about now? No! How? No! Uh, Erico? Unchanged over the centuries, fly fishing is more than just a sport. For some fly fishermen, it's Can we part. switch to cartoons instead? <laughs> Abuelita loves documentaries. The laws are often made by the fly fishermen themselves, <sighs> taking long hours of meticulous preparation. <sharp inhale> That's the end of our program. And now, a look at the reproductive cycle <sighs> of jellyfish. Contrary to popular belief, jellyfish do... <gasps> <gasps> what? Already? We've got to take Abuelita back to her retirement home. <sharp inhale> look. 
she's sleeping. We don't want to disturb her. Mm. Hey, where am I gonna sleep? Shh! Old people's sleep is sacred. She's so adorable when she sleeps. There we go. I've got tickets for mini motorcycling. Awesome! Oops, but I only have two. Looks like Abuelita will have to go back to the retirement home. But it's too rough for someone her age. You kidding? She survived several wars. What's a mini bike track to her? Hey, Daniel, do you like donuts? <laughs> What's that? Practice! She played for the national team. Still in good shape, huh? Kian me faras chichi. Abuelita! Abuelita! Tomorrow we can squeeze in canoeing just after laser tag if we don't spend too long bowling. What? But we were supposed to go to the game together tomorrow! I even got us matching ball caps. You want us to just leave, Abuelita? Have you no heart? That does it! Ever since Abuelita got here, you've spent all your time with her! Come on, why so jealous, Daniel? You haven't seen Daniel, have you? Please disappoint me. Don't tell me he's still sulking. <laughs> ah! Daniel? What are you doing? Since you like Abuelita better, I decided to become an old lady, too. Take that wig off! You look ridiculous, Daniel. Hmm? Abuelita, I hope you and Erico are happy! Still huh? no news of Mrs. Silvia Martinez, who has disappeared from her retirement home. Mom has never done this before. The kids are absolutely devastated. Chuvi, estas mi filino. Erico, are you really, really sure that this is Abuelita? Now that you mention it, her eyes were green, and she had a wooden leg. What? Hey, you're the one who told me it was her. I wasn't sure, but you seem so happy. That means... We've kidnapped an old lady! Okay, we need to take her back, right now! But everybody's looking for her, Erico. If somebody recognizes her outside, we're gonna go to prison! To prison! If you have any information regarding the disappearance of Mrs. Martinez, please contact the police immediately. No! Okay, stop, stop. We're gonna find a solution, Daniel. Orange doesn't suit me at all. Ugh, and close that window! Abuelita's gonna catch a cold. Old people's health is sacred, Daniel. Oh no, my hat! My scarf as well! And my funny glasses! Hmm. Coast is clear, Erico. It's you! I know you. I saw you on TV. The dress of my dreams! <sighs> there 
you are. I knew I'd find you. My self-esteem. Wait, 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 wait. Forgetting your bus ticket? <sighs> wait, 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 wait. You think I don't see what's going on with your old mustachioed friend? He gets a senior citizen discount. <sighs> wait, 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 wait. Have a splendid day. I like that one. Yeah, a little too festive, right? Ah, there you go. That one's scary. We drop her here, ring the bell, and run for it. Ready, Daniel? What are you waiting for? I can't do this. I just can't leave Abuelita like this. But she's not Abuelita. How would you know? You said she had a wooden leg! Well, lizard's tails grow back! Abuelita, you want to go? Vima truffles means tulta bando. Mrs. Martinez, we were so worried about you. That's it. She's gone now. So what did she say when she was hugging us? She said that as we go forward in life, leaving memories behind, we should keep them in our hearts and learn to cherish them. Aww. It was either that or let me go inside. It's freezing out here. <laughs> I'm not sure. Shirt, cleats, socks. My shirt! Can't play without them, it's too dangerous! Ha! <laughs> Baloney! Scars are a player's badge of honor. Here, look. You know why I sink like a rock in the pool? No. <laughs> Titanium knees. And you know why I beep at the airport? No. <laughs> Titanium ribs. And haven't you ever seen the scar on my back? No! Believe me, Daniel, nobody cares about your precious shin guards. Kids, we have a visitor today. Just pretend I'm not here. <laughs> We're having a safety inspection by the city, so let's be extra careful now, hazelnuts. Not to blow my own horn, but we've come a long way on safety. I'm open! I'm open! Hmm? Okay, that'll do. So how'd we do? Ten out of ten? In only ten minutes, you committed 137 safety infractions. Dangerous tackling. Oh! Excessive noise. Ah! No shin guards. Ah! Turf. Cracks. Vegetables, shaving cream, and the fire extinguishers. The Hazelnuts Club is officially... No! Closed. <laughs> Please, Mr. Safety Man, don't shut our club down. We'll do anything you want. Your determination inspires me. What's your name, little one? Daniel Sisu. Daniel Sisu, here is the boxed set of oh. safety and prevention. If I see tangible improvement on my next inspection, I'll rescind my decision. Security lesson number one. Oh, Dread, my snack. <laughs> dread and double Dread. At least I still have one good hand. 
That's why we always have snack time after practice. Mm-hmm. Now, oh, come on. I didn't have all these rules, and I'm perfectly fine. Hmm? I don't know. It looks like ex-footballers have all sorts of problems. Hearing loss, mood swings, memory loss. What? Baloney! <laughs> nah, I'm all right. What are we talking about again? F football damaged me? No. Did it? No. <laughs> <laughs> Football has betrayed me, Daniel. My body's in ruins. You've got to save those children, Daniel. Don't let them end up like me. Safety! More safety? More safety. Maximum safety! Letting him shut us down. We'll show the inspector how safe we can be. Yeah! Over here! No sudden movements. Mm -hmm. Over here! Too loud. Mm. Over here! Wait. I'm wondering about the ball. Look, Daniel, I know... Shh. Daniel, I know you're trying to make things better, but I think we're going a little overboard. Hmm? <laughs> and that's why you should always play with a well-inflated ball. What were you saying about the ball? <laughs> Over here. <gasps> this is perfect, Erico. No contact, no risk. We've saved football, Daniel. Look out, a huge bumblebee. No sudden movements, there is nothing to be afraid of. I'll be okay, kids. Don't worry. We failed, Erico. We did our best, but danger's all around us. <laughs> hmm? Hi, Daniel. Hello. <sighs> Ah, good doggy. <laughs> Hi there, little guy. You okay, Erico? You seem tense. Who? Me? Tense? <laughs> <laughs> Erico, you home? <gasps> wow! Yep, check out my titanium sealed reinforced silicone housing. Awesome, Erico! <gasps> hey, I know how to save the hazelnuts! <laughs> Kill it! Kill it! Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, I did it! <laughs> no, I can't end like this! <laughs> Let's go, Plutana! Welcome to the team. You're fired! Great game, Plutana! World champion! Here we go! Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. You're my best friend, Erico. Wow. <laughs> Perfect! Color me impressed, Daniel Sisu. Complete protection. Bold move. It's just a hundred old sweaters. <laughs> Did anyone just hear a titanium sealed reinforced silicone ball crashing into aluminum garbage cans? Hmm? No. Uh, 
Will you excuse me for a moment? <laughs> Erico! Are you okay? I saw my whole life flash before my eyes, Daniel. It was awesome! But it made me realize something. Huh? You can't be a winner by staying in your shell. In life, you have to be able to take risks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Remarkable, Daniel Sisu. Hold it! Safety is important, and so is taking care of our health. But if we can't have fun, it isn't football anymore. Uh. Uh. Disappointing, Daniel Sisu. Hmm? A tear? Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> Watch your fingers, Hassan! Fasten your seatbelt! Don't touch that! Don't go near the edge! Look carefully before you cross! Mr. Safety Man? This inspection is cancelled. You've saved your club and opened my eyes. You can keep the jacket. Time for me to follow my dream. To become an extreme sports athlete. Thank you, Daniel Sisu. Oh, that's the coolest guy I ever met. <laughs> <clears throat> After you, of course. <laughs> Stop! You can't bungee jump from a hang glider! It's way too dangerous! To live your life to the fullest, sometimes you've got to take chances. Again? You know that story by heart. Oh, come on, please! Oh, fine, okay. <clears throat> In 2011, Platana's hairstyle not only shocked millions of spectators, it also completely reinvented Mohawk sideburns. Mohawk sideburns? Hmm. You know, speaking of hairstyles, Daniel, it's about time we take care of yours. Really? But, uh, Mom is the one who cuts my hair. Oh, Daniel, Daniel. Don't you think the greatest football player on the planet would also be the greatest hairstylist on the planet? Huh? Uh, okay. Oh, I knew you'd come to your senses. So, given the shape of your head, we're gonna have to be a little creative. Hmm. Good morning, world. Good morning, my little kettle. Good morning, my little squashes. Good morning, my lower back. Good morning, my little cup. Get up, get up. Get up, get up. Oh, 3 p.m. already? Time to get ready for practice. Good afternoon, my little hazelnuts. Say, where's Daniel? <laughs> Sisu, 
you look like a kneecap that tried to grow a beard. <laughs> <laughs> you look like an old fogey trying to look younger. <laughs> you know who you look like? You look exactly like... Oh. <laughs> today's today's practice is canceled. I'm just not feeling up to it. <laughs> Maple, I'm sorry. I wasn't trying to make fun of you. <laughs> <laughs> nice work, Sisu. Now Maple will never want to coach us again. He always tied my laces for me. <laughs> he always made the coolest cupcakes. <laughs> Where are we gonna get a new coach now? <laughs> when they assigned this team to me, everyone said it was a lost cause. Who are you? Boy, were they ever wrong. You guys stink, but that's about to change. I'm gonna turn you into champions. <laughs> Any questions? <laughs> You're off the team! Everyone else, 10 laps. <laughs> uh, are you sure you know what you're doing, Eriko? Uh, you've never coached a team before. Daniel, shh, Daniel. Has it ever occurred to you that the greatest football player and hairstylist on the planet would also be a champion coach? Uh, is champion coach a thing? Hey! Don't think I can't see you dragging your feet! I'm gonna sculpt your pudgy little bodies into winning machines! <laughs> Thirsty! A real champion licks the dew off the field! You're off the team! <sighs> hey, what's this? Uh, You're off the team! <laughs> Maya, what do you think of the new coach? He's an insecure tyrant who will drive us into utter chaos and disaster. Maya, is that Velcro laces I see on your shoes? You're off the team! Have fun with that! That's enough! Eriko, we need to talk. You're off the team! Oh, it's you. Sorry, Daniel. Uh, so, what's up? You can't just get rid of everyone. I'm the only one left! Yeah, uh, no. There's still, um, uh, Steven? <laughs> You're off the team! Oh, well, uh... If they don't have what it takes, we'll just buy better players. Is that it? I told you we had no money. No one is that broke. Maple must have stashed some cash somewhere. So what do we have here? Nothing. 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 Well, there has to be something. How can somebody be this broke? Seriously. <sighs> Erica, wait! We need to get the hazelnuts to come back! What? Never! Changing your mind makes you look weak. We need them! Trust me! It's never too late to put the pieces back together. Now we can get back to practice. No, Eriko! You might be the greatest football player in the world, but Maple is a better coach than you! 
Are you kidding? Maybe one day you'll be a great coach, but right now we need to find Maple. Hey, good morning, world. Watch up, hot chat. Nice dive. Hey, Hansel. Hop back at you. Hiya, Sylvia. How you doing? Hey. What's the best way to make a small fortune in the stock market? Start off with a big fortune. <laughs> <laughs> good one, Patrick. Good one. Bye, bye. Sell, sell! Bye for goodness sake! Maple, hmm? you here? Wow, Maple! Daniel? We're sorry about everything. Is everything okay, Michael? Children aren't allowed on the sales floor. Everything's fine, Jane. I've got it under control. We're sorry about everything, Maple. That's not my name anymore, Daniel. I've left that life behind me. And here we go! We're really sorry, Maple! Really, really sorry! <laughs> Is everything okay, Michael? We failed! Maple isn't coming back. No more hazelnuts. No more, no more hazelnuts. Bye. Hmm? Ah. Guys, wait up, Maple. I'll never abandon you again. <laughs> <laughs> the program today is... Meditation and Tribal Percussion. Yay! <laughs> well, my work here is done. I'm leaving. Wait, 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 wait. Don't I get a song? <sighs> Goodbye, Mr. Coach. We sure had fun, but now, now it's, it's done. done. Now it's done! Yeah. Make me proud, kids. And don't forget, never give away my autograph for free. Holy moly, Daniel! Such amazing progress! I'm flabbergasted! So, how do you like those new magic sneakers? They're not magic, Eriko. I know you made that up just to show me that the power to win was all along... ...in my heart. <laughs> what? Of course they're magic! I bought them from the sorcerer! Huh? You mean they're really magic? Now that you mention it... I think he said cursed. Your cursed sneakers! Cursed, yep, he definitely said cursed sneakers. <laughs> you can't throw away a gift! With those sneakers, you'll be a champion in three weeks! Cheating is wrong! And your sneakers are freaking me out. Yeah, I'll never get my body back at this rate. How's that for cursed? Oh, 
Whoa, whoa, what's the matter? It's the sneakers, Eriko. They're back on my feet. I'm cursed. Cursed! Stop making it all about you. Think of the team. Did you see their faces when you were playing with them yesterday? Their eyes were filled with pride, love, and dare I say hope. They were? They were. But hey, if you want to throw their dreams in the old trash can, that's totally your call. Just get rid of the sneakers. Hmm? Also, if you keep them, you and I are both the same. Both cursed. <laughs> cursed! Great game out there, Daniel. So great that it's making me jealous. So great that... So great that I feel like a loser. I'm so jealous. We're just not good enough anymore. What's your secret, Daniel? What's your secret? I'm begging you, Daniel. Tell us your secret. I'm begging you. <sighs> I'm not really supposed to say anything, but... Hmm? I'm begging you! It's my sneakers. <gasps> hey, are we cursed or what? <laughs> cursed! I'm so glad you came around in the end. The sorcerer told me you'd get used to the side effects. The what? <laughs> <laughs> there we go. I can't sleep. It's only flies and weird voices. Go back to sleep. It's not that. It's the bed. And my sneakers are being mean to me. Hmm? Oh, my sneakers are being mean. We'll see about that tomorrow on the field. I'm not sure I like being cursed. Hey, you're not the only one cursed here. Do you hear me whining? Uh, yeah, all the time. Hmm, being a champion isn't easy, okay? Come on, go back to sleep. <sighs> mm -hmm. Hey, what's huh? going on? Daniel, is it me or are they all wearing cursed sneakers? I might have shown them my pair. And the Sorcerer's Online shop. And sponsored them to sign up. Sign on the dotted line with your blood. 15% off your next purchase. What a bargain. Hmm? Ouch! Curse my aching back! <laughs> Curse. Or did the level just go up a notch around here? This is awful, Erico! Let's not jump to conclusions, Daniel. Once I bought the cape and the hat, I couldn't let the belt and the gauntlet pass me by. And let's not jump to conclusions. I shouldn't have bought the cursed earrings. <laughs> okay, we may have gone a bit too far. <laughs> Listen up! <clears throat> sure, these sneakers have raised our game. Mm -hmm. But look at what we've become. Hmm. Daniel's right! It's not really nice on the other side! We won't play so well if we take them off. But at least we'll be ourselves again. <laughs> no more curses! No more curses! We sure had a good scare, right? Yes, but all's well that ends well. Psych! I wasn't even scared. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! I forgot! Why did they 
always come back. Ah, shouldn't have gone for the lifetime guarantee. Okay, let's go see the sorcerer. But I warn you, you're doing the talking. Well, yeah, the screams, yeah. Well, maybe you shouldn't have signed up for the full moon special offer. What can I do for you? It's the cursed sneakers. We don't want them anymore. Uh, sorry. Mm -hmm. No refund or exchange on the cursed items. <whistles> hmm? Sorcerer speaking. Please, Mr. Sorcerer. We'll do anything to get rid mm -hmm. of them. An evil pressure cooker? Let me just see what's in stock. <coughs> yeah. mm -hmm. You okay? I should have never turned my massage therapist into a potty hat! Maybe what you need is... a little back rub. Come on! Any day now! Good luck, kid. Oh, cold hands! I can't stand cold hands! Oh, my aching back! I'll never be able to take back all those sneakers. Mm. I can't. I just can't do it. Take this, Eriko. What's that? It's my magic pet rock. It'll give you strength. Are you kidding me? Trust me, with this stone, you can do anything. <laughs> Y'all knock off the baloney. It is baloney, right? Oh, yes. Yeah, right there. Oh, yeah, on the lower back. Harder. Oh, you have magic pants. Oh, thanks. I feel like a new man. Come on, kids. In you go. You were right, Daniel. That pet rock is magic. I felt its energy spread through my body. It was incredible. <laughs> Fooled you! There's no such thing as magic pet rocks. It was just an old pebble I found in my pocket. The real magic was in your heart all along. Uh, Erico? I don't know when or how, but one day I'll get my revenge and you'll spend your life regretting this little joke. What? No, nothing. I mean, ha, 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 oh, you really got me this time. <laughs> <laughs> no more curses! Huh, speak for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I slept like a cherub on a cloud. And look at all these pollinating insects. That's just what our vegetable patch needs. And just when I thought my day couldn't get any better, look what I found in the trash! Huh? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs>